What's up guys, it's Dan Darcy here, and today I've got new cheese to try. We have cheddar, but two different types. We have an 11 year old aged cheddar, and we have a three year old aged cheddar. So the goal with this video is to see, is there a difference in the aging process? Is there a taste difference? Now, my prediction says no. However, based on the price of these cheeses, maybe yes. In fact, the 11 year old cheddar is almost three times as much as the three year old aged cheddar. So without any further ado, let's open these bad boys up and let's see what we got. All right, so this is the three-year-old aged cheddar. Uh, it's a pretty big brick. It's got a pretty sharp texture to it. Not very flexible. It oh, smells really sharp. All right, let's cut into this and let's see what we got. This is kind of what it looks like. I don't know if you can see that. All right, here we go. Oh wow. Super sharp. I can understand now why they nicknamed this specific cheese Super Sharp. It's a really sharp flavor. A little creamy, but not much. Overall, not bad. So that was the three-year-old. Let's open up this 11-year-old and see if there's any difference. All right, so here we go. We've got the 11 year old aged cheddar. We're gonna see if this makes any difference or not. So let's break a little off. There's definitely, definitely a difference. This one overall tastes a lot better. It's a hell of a lot sharper. And there's definitely, just taste the three again. Yeah, the three, the three is pretty weak compared to the 11. I'm actually pretty surprised at the difference. When you take a bite out of the 11, it's almost like this blast of just cheddar in your mouth, whereas the three has more of a milky, creamy flavor to it and isn't quite as sharp. So I'm gonna go ahead and give these a little bit more time and get used to them and I'll come back and give my final thoughts. So before I get to my final thoughts, I do wanna say that I've tried many different cheddars over my lifetime with many different ages. However, I've never gotten to do a side-by-side -side comparison like this with such a large age gap between the two cheeses. So I was really excited to make this video. A few moments later. All right guys, so I've had some time with the two cheeses to get used to them. And I will say this, again, there definitely is a difference between the 11 and three year old aged cheddar. If you want something that's much sharper and almost has a bit of a crunch to it, then I would go with the 11. If you're someone who is into the more mild uh, cheddar and likes that milky flavor, then I would definitely go with the three-year-old aged cheddar. My personal favorite as of right now has gotta be the 11-year-old, just because it's more sharp and it really hits you uh, with a bold flavor when you eat it. Thank you guys for watching and please make sure to like, subscribe, and check out my other cheese videos. Maybe I can't open it. <laughs> how do I, how do I open the cheese? Damn it! Should I start with this one? All right, let me get like a knife. Yeah. So I'm not just like. <laughs> a knife just pops <laughs> up. Um, they package this one really weird. I struggle at <laughs> opening cheese. So I'm gonna go ahead and give these a little bit more time and get used to them, and I'll come back and give my <laughs> final thoughts. <laughs> You motherfucker. <laughs> My final bark! <laughs>